Hello, I'm Juan Azorgo, a structure specialist. And in this video, I'm going to discuss the content of this course called Earthquake Resistant Design using ETAB 17.0.1. This course is the second part of the course continuing on from the previous course. In part two, we're going to be designing the calculators for a foundation slab. For example, the pressure that the floor will apply to the foundation slab. We are going to take a look at the whole building. Remember, this building is the one we calculated in the previous course. It will have eight levels with stairs and an elevator. We will work with the design strips using ETAB software to calculate the reinforcing steel. We will also compare the soil structure interaction of each design the different behavior of each, and how this influences the shear walls. In this course, we will compare the soil structure interaction of a shear wall with an example when the base is embedded. We will see the difference is even framed across a period of time. For example, remember the building we studied last year. We calculated 0.76 seconds. Well, in this case, for the soil structure interaction, we obtained 0.96 seconds. We will study the differences and how to take this into account in the soil structure interaction. We will also work with the foundation slab details for all of the strips that will be generated during the course. On the other hand, we will study the changes that will be made to all designs. Finally, as a part of this course, we will carry out the detail of all the foundation slab strips in both the X and Y axes. I hope this introduction has given you an overview of what you're about to learn and helped you understand the goals of this course. See you again soon.